uh, Kieran, thank you very much for uh, for coming on and uh, being being the uh, stand up pro Israel person in Ireland for today. One of many. <laughs> so let's maybe kind of just start there because you you say one of many, and the perception from Israel, as I'm sure you know, is that um, it's very very anti. Um, but I've heard the theory for quite a while that there is more pro Israel support or people who are sort of more neutral uh, than meets the eye. What, what do you have to say about that? Um, it's definitely more than you see on social media. I would understand anybody looking at Irish Twitter thinking that the vast majority of Irish people were very anti-Israel. But, um, you know, the opinion polls don't really bear that out. Uh, there was one opinion poll recently from the Sunday Independent that, um, unfortunately, I don't have the exact figures anymore because they're now behind the paywall. I think it was something like Okay, it was 51% said they favoured Palestine or Palestinians and it was only about 10% favoured Israel or supported Israel in this in this conflict. But um, that left something like, what, 39% who were quite nuanced in their view and took the point of view that um, they didn't really feel like supporting either side. And that same opinion poll also showed that 66% of Irish people support Hamas being prescribed as a, ter- as a terrorist organisation. <clears throat> and surprisingly enough, even the majority of Sinn Féinals support Hamas being prescribed as a terrorist organisation. So you don't see that coming out on Twitter. You know, you, you, at best you will see, particularly from politicians like people from people on People Before Profit, if they, if they probably won't condemn Hamas at all, um, and to do, um, it's very, very kind of perfunctory and fleeting. Um, so I think people's views are somewhat more nuanced than social media would, would lead one to believe.